the Pandora Arcade Sticks. Man, I love these things right here. Each one uh, provides a different type of game for me. That's why I got uh, so many of these. I even have a mini arcade version of the Pandora Sticks. And this is pretty cool right here. I made a video on this one. It's kind of cool. But yeah, I love these things. Now, are they worth it? Well, let's find out. Let's do it. Welcome back to Gamer to Gamer. And I've been playing games and collecting games ever since I was a kid. So therefore, I decided to start this channel up. So if you like my videos, smash that like button and subscribe. So without further ado, let's start the video. Welcome back to Gamer to Gamer and check it out. Today we're going to talk about my Pandora uh, arcade sticks. Man, these things are super cool. I really like them. So why do I have uh, so many? Because uh, each one provides different style of games. Now, should you get one? I say, yeah, these things come with tons of games. I mean, they come with shoot 'em ups, beat 'em ups, fighting games. They, they just got so many. I'm talking puzzle games. There's tons of games on these things. But I do want, want to say right off the bat, all these uh, arcade uh, sticks here, they all share the same games. They all got Batman games on them. They all got Superman games on them. They all got Street Fighter games on them. I mean, they all have the same games. And a lot of these games are nothing but duplicates. They're just duplicates of other games on here. So uh, you're going to find that a lot. A lot of the same games on, on these things. But what separates a lot of these things are some of them have 3D games on them. Like, uh, let's see. Which one is it? Let's see here. This one right here has a lot of 3D games on them. So all these uh, devices specialize in certain type of games. But mostly uh, people get them to, uh, to remind them of that arcade feel. Like playing Street Fighter and Dark Stalkers and... You know, so many other games like wrestling games that used to be in the arcades, you know, they're on here. They really are. But I must say, I haven't found any inappropriate games on here. So that's that right there is a plus. But one of the main reason I got uh, all these is because of the beat em ups. Each one of these have different beat em ups on them. You know, every blue moon you might find uh, something on here that is like, wow, where'd that come from? Like Judge Dredd. Like Judge Dredd in 3D is on one of these. I forgot which one. But yeah, sometimes you find some hidden gems on these things. But I bought this strictly for beat-em-ups. I love beat-em-ups. And man, do they have a lot of classic games on here. I'm talking classic games. I mean, if you want if you want one of these machines just for classic games, bam, this is it right here. I mean, they're awesome for classic games. Hey, you like playing uh, Street Fighter type of games, like fighting games? Oh, this is it. I mean, these arcade sticks, man, they got some wear and, I mean, it's wear and tear on these sticks. And man, I haven't had a single problem out of any of these sticks. They all survived the test of time. But let's just say if you don't want to play with the with the sticks, you could also hook up um, uh, other uh, controllers to it, and you can even Bluetooth some of these. So it's kind of cool. And I got a lot of controllers, as you guys know, I'm a controller guy. And yeah, you can hook up different style controllers. You can hook up Super Nintendo style controllers, N64 style controllers, Sega Genesis style. The list goes on and on and on. But buying one of these, yeah, you can't really go wrong. You can't really go wrong. They're just super fun. And man, you're going to spend hours and hours just going down a list, just searching for all the different style of games they got on there. Man, they got so many games. <laughs> it is crazy. But is it worth it? Yes, it's definitely worth getting one of these. 
I mean, I don't have anything bad to say about them. It's only thing bad I got to say about these is there's a lot of duplicates games. And, you know, they're what I call filler games. You know, just like if they got 5,000 games on here, I'm pretty sure a thousand of those are going to be duplicates. <laughs> it's crazy. But hey, thanks for watching. Gamer to Gamer. Peace.